We all know that proper etiquette can help us in social situations, weddings, unfamiliar places, and more. But did you know that you can use those tools to help at work as well? Here was some great information on how we can use proper etiquette to actually score a raise at work. We have Marianne Parker here from Manor of Manners International. Welcome to the thank show. Thank you, thank you. I'm so glad that we're talking about this because I need a raise. <laughs> All right, let's talk about <laughs> etiquette at work. Are there certain things that we should remember? We always have to remember that we have to be very polite, very respectful, and to make people feel comfortable around us because mm -hmm. I think that this is the most important thing. Yes, absolutely. So, so what are the no-nos? Well, um, the dress code is very crucial. Mm -hmm. uh, the fact that uh, you don't remember uh, your um, uh, a co-worker's birthday, for example, sometimes could be a little um, bit off because obviously you're not very um, involved with the uh, fabric of the, co um, the company or mm -hmm. your friends uh, at work. So this could be also distracting. Okay. All right. So you say that you have five proven tips uh, to get a raise at work. All right. Let's talk about first up, act with integrity. Well, this is very important because I don't know if you knew, but 52%, according to USA Today, there is a statistic, 52% of the workers last year didn't get an increase. This is a very significant percentage. So what do we do? Um, a lot of people have very strong hard skills, but if you combine them with the social skills, you definitely can increase your social status. Your, you definitely can get an increase and you have to act with integrity due to the fact that you don't want people to know you for this person who behaves appropriately only when the boss is watching. Yes. You want to do the right thing every single time because mm -hmm. this is going to become a habit and also you don't want to do it for anybody else but your integrity. Yes. So I think that that's very important for business. Always act like the boss is watching. There you <laughs> yes. go. Okay, next be punctual. Why is that important? Punctual, punctuality is one of the most important skills that we actually can have. And mm -hmm. especially in the United States, I don't know if you are aware, but we're very punctual based on the fact that this comes from the time of the gold rush and the land grabs when if you're not the first, you're going to be the last. Gonna so be the, last, the first right. comes, the first the serves. Surf, you're going to yeah. get the gold only if you're on time. Two o'clock in the morning, you need to be there. <laughs> Otherwise, somebody else will be there. So you need to be very, very punctual because you want to respect the other person's time. Yeah. Yes. So this becomes our, um, is part of the nature, right. the American nature. Yeah. So yeah. That's, that's very so important. true. All right, and then you mentioned the dress code. That's very mm -hmm. important. Why dress should we follow that? Important. Dress code is very important because if you want to get a raise, you need to act the part. And you don't want to show disrespect to, to the company, to your position, because you need to handle everything very responsibly. Mm -hmm. And uh, when you come to work with flip-flops or something against the dress code or bare arms, uh, you don't want to do su 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 such a things. Also, just you don't need to be uh, wearing the most expensive clothing but at least you need to always try to iron your clothes or no stains and just to um, look polished mm -hmm. and uh, I think it's very very important okay and then what are some no-nos would you um, say for the for the dress code yes well definitely not flip-flops if okay. you're in California I've seen it many times uh -huh. so um, also uh, try to avoid a lot of makeup for the ladies especially if you uh, wear a lot of makeup try to mute it mm -hmm. very strong fragrances perfumes colognes are also out of the question because people have uh, allergies it's just uh, not appropriate thing to do yes all right let's talk about um, avoiding workplace gossip why is that important? Oh, gossip actually um, is extremely important because this brings a lot of toxicity in the workplace. Mm -hmm. If I talk to you and everybody else knows that I'm talking to you, probably when I talk to this particular person next to me, they know already that this is my character. Yeah. So I think it's very, very inappropriate. You don't want to be involved with anything as such. Yes, so it always it's gets very, back very, to that person yes. no matter what you think. You definitely can get increased <laughs> uh, in that way. Sticky situations. <laughs> okay, so if we want more information, we can go to your website, right? Mannerofmanners.com. Mannerofmanners.com. Yes. Thank you so much. Thank you so much.